No, don't remove your mask. Don't remove your mask. Don't mask. remove your mask. Mask. Mask on. Mask. Put on your mask. Mask. Put on your mask, Honorable Alice Wahome, and you have the floor. Put on yes, your mask. Uh, thank you. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Thank you. Proceed. Yeah, with your mask on. Th thank you. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. At the outset, I rise to oppose this bill on basis of one, its timing. This bill is completely untimely and it is intended to disrupt smooth nominations, particularly in some of the proposals that it is coming up with. The, the speed, Mr. Speaker, Mr. Speaker, the speed, the speed in which even from the speaker's seat, that this bill is being processed, Mr. Speaker, completely ignoring procedural issues, directly points, directly points to a situation where the country is being asked to run quickly. Mr. Speaker, Mr. Speaker, this bill, this bill runs contrary to the Constitution of Kenya 2010, especially when you look at the proposals regarding formation of a political party. The definition of what is a political party, Mr. Speaker, cannot be changed by a legislative enactment, Mr. Speaker. And that's what this bill, Mr. Speaker, is trying to do in some of the proposals that it has come up with. Mr. Speaker, even the fact that we have been summoned in a, for a special meeting, Mr. Speaker, sitting of this house, points to the direction that there are people intended on controlling the general elections through this bill, Mr. Speaker, in August 2022. You will, you will allow me to say my thing because we can see through these provisions the hand the hand of the hardship partners, Mr. Speaker, who are now desperate and think that they can use the law, use this house, Mr. Speaker, to bring up provisions of the law that will facilitate an amorphous coalition of parties. The law today, Mr. Speaker, the law today, the law today, Mr. Speaker, allows coalition of parties. It allows coalition of political parties by the deposit of a memorandum to the legislature of political parties. What is this, this thing that has become so urgent, Mr. Speaker, that requires the session of the House to be called from leave, Mr. Speaker, to come and register it? When you look at the provision, every election period, Mr. Speaker, we find that there are disruptive provisions of the law that have been brought or are intended to give undue advantage to some people. Mr. Speaker, Mr. Speaker, I'm therefore finding that the exercise of this House today, the summoning of this House today in respect of this bill, absolutely unnecessary, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, the control, I will be moving some amendments, Mr. Speaker, on the register, the register of members. We cannot allow, we cannot allow the register of political parties to be the holder of the data of members of political parties. And Mr. Speaker, this is a very serious attempt by the register of political parties with the deep state idea say to control the register of members of political parties. And that will not be allowed, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, it is a shame that when people, people are dying, people have eaten, have taken cancer billions, we are being summoned today to discuss about the formation of coalitions instead, Mr. Speaker, of dealing with the pandemic, including the pandemic in this house, Mr. Speaker, where yesterday,
every eight people out of ten who were tested, Mr. Speaker, turned positive, COVID positive yesterday. It is even exposing the members, Mr. Speaker, with a very useless bill. With a very useless bill, Mr. Speaker. This is not a pro people bill. Mr. Speaker, this is not a pro people bill. This is a very selfish move by this House today. We have a political parties act that is able to deal with the issues of elections and nominations going forward. If, for example, bad habits, like the ones of the ODM, by denying other parties their money, if that is what they are trying to cure, that cannot be cured by the law, Mr. Speaker. That can only be cured through good behavior, Mr. Speaker. And therefore, we want to tell them, you can deposit a memorandum of how you share the money and honor the memorandum, because many of you have never known how to honor memorandums, to honor gentlemen agreement and ladies agreement. Mr. Speaker, I do not want to add anything. And, and we are happy that people, Mr. Speaker, are you, <coughs> uh, Mr. Speaker, you know there are people, there are people, Mr. Speaker, that have become used about intimidation, about wanting to curtail the democratic space of other people. Mr. Speaker, I am on the floor of the House, and if you mean you want to curtail the independence, the freedom of speech, including in the House, I think, uh, honorable members, we are going the wrong direction. This bill, this bill will, if this bill, Mr. Speaker, and I want to go on record, if this bill is passed, this bill will find difficulties and challenges in court by reason